guess what? It actually burns in the water. How is it possible? Small piece of ice over there. And let's pour it on ice. Let's see what happens. Check it out. So keep going. Isn't it awesome? First we're gonna put distilled water into the glass. Then we're gonna put the glass in the microwave. And this kind of glass will take about 4 minutes first to heat it up and And we're gonna add some sugar in our tea. And guess what? Your wood tea would explode and burn you. Check it out, we got a glass of water and we're gonna drop a coin and see what happens. Water exploded. Boom! A token! And check it out, that broke just perfectly. slowly and just stick the tip and we'll see what happens wow was that crazy what do you guys think so the head matches over there then we're gonna grab the bottle and squeeze as hard as we can as you can see the match is gonna sink and if I let go they're gonna go back up isn't it magic so let's check it out Keep squeezing and then they're gonna go all the way bottom. Look, the third one going. The more pressure you're gonna put, the more much is gonna go down. Pretty cool, huh? What I'm gonna do is grab the plastic cover, put it over and like that. And guess what? Then if I let go, cover gonna suck in into the glass and water is not gonna fall out it's because of the pressure over here builds up and that's why it sucks in the cover that's simple everybody knows it but what if i move this part why is the water not falling out this is just a fish net and there's a lot of tiny holes and more than tiny it's like a net i mean fish net mosquito net there's a lot of tiny holes and it should be falling super easy and that's not falling out. What if I like kind of drop it? Boom! And all water falls out. Look how easy it's going to. First we will take one of the birthday candles and take off the wax from it. So we're gonna just take the wig out of the candle. Then we will need to cut a piece out of a clear plastic, something like that. Then we will make a hole right in the middle, but this big, so this uh, will push through here, the wig. Then we're gonna grab our glass with water and fill it up with our oil. I got torch fluid, you can use something else. Now we're just gonna set it on top of water, and as you can see, clear plastic, you almost cannot see it. But because of water tension, it's just floating on top of water. As you can see, the plastic is invisible in water, almost. And the wig doesn't sink. So it looks like the wig just floating in the air. So then we're gonna set the wig on fire. And you got floating candle. Doesn't it look amazing? So check it out. Candle looks like just floats on the water. What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority. Well, I'm not in my laboratory, I'm still in Las Vegas. And today I'm gonna show you a very cool science experiment. It's called Magic Sense. Let's check it out what it is about. Check it out, we're gonna need a glass of water. So, let's check it out. I'm gonna grab a spoon of this Magic Sand. And pour it 
in a glass. Let's see what happens. Do you see that? Let's send. You see, it's dry. Let's pull a whole bunch in there, in the glass. See what happens. Check it out. It just doesn't... Doesn't get wet, you know what I mean? This is very cool. How is it possible? It's like... You see, it just doesn't get wet. So, let's check it out. I'm gonna grab the sand and pull it from the water. And you see, it's just like normal sand. And it just sinks up. Look at this. Pretty crazy, huh?